guys and welcome back to my channel hi guys i'm kelechi mwamena and in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys some tips on how to film your first youtube video now if you're someone who has been struggling with how to film what you need to say how to set up all of that let me just say I have you covered in this video i'm going to be walking you guys through this step-by-step -step process as well as sharing with you guys some tips that you can implement to ease your filming process and to make your first time filming experience amazing so if you are interested then definitely do keep on watching okay guys so now that you're here let's get started have your camera get your phone all of that get your pen let's just roll with this okay so in this video, we're going to be in-depth, very detailed, very beginner-friendly and sequential. So get your pen, get your paper, get whatever you need to take notes because you're going to actually have to apply all of these steps onto your content, onto your channel in order to ease the first content. The first is always the hardest. The first content is always going to be your worst content, no matter how much you try to perfect it. But in this video, I'm going to try and, as much as possible to make it as seamless and as easy for you guys to start creating. All right, guys. So the first thing you need to do is to do your research. And if you are already watching this video, it means that you're already doing your research. You're trying to figure out how to film, what you need to do, what you need, how to start off. Basically, you're trying to enlighten yourself with this whole experience. The more knowledge you have on what to do, what not to do from people who are actually doing it, from people who are sort of experienced in it. Again, do your research, figure out what people are doing, what are they saying, how are they doing it, how then can I implement it to my own content it's easy so that way you're not confused and when you need you already know what you need you already know what to do and you're ready to get started so my second step is to have an idea right so if you are someone who is planning on doing or starting up your youtube channel or filming a content odds are is that you already have an idea or a topic or something you want to talk about or you want to create content on so have that idea and if you are confused on what to start off with, what you need to say, what topic to cover, you know, if you don't know what you need to start off with, then the best thing I can tell you is that just start off with a content talking about yourself, your channel, and what you have to offer. So it could be like a three mini, three minutes mini channel thriller talking about who you are, you know your experiences your youtube channel what is going to be about why you're on youtube basically an intro video again there's no one that knows you like you do so this is the this is going to be the easiest topic or the easiest youtube first content to create so just like a short video talk, talk about yourself hi my name is Kelly Chimbemina and I'm a beauty lifestyle social media whatever you are um, this is what I do I create content like this to help you create content on YouTube I talk about this I have that degree I have this degree and this is what you guys will learn from my channel blah 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 yada 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 look for how to make it fun again since you're talking about yourself show a little bit of personality and yeah again this is the first video it's always going to be the worst no matter how perfect you want it to be so i like to say just get it over with again get a topic you want to talk about and if you don't have one yet or you're confused on how to start off with start off with yourself you are the best person to talk about yourself again you're so unique so do an intro about your channel it could be one minute so that way when you have one content idea you can now start generalizing and getting more ideas and content topics to talk about in your video okay so the third thing i would advise you to do is to write it down this is what you call scripting you want to be as detailed as possible again i practice this on every content i have a script right here you guys probably already know it's got, i like to show this every time in my content have a script out so that way you're not blabbing you're not going off point you're not talking for 10 hours you are as focused as possible so for instance if you're talking about yourself write an intro script like just like some key points your name your educational background as if you're talking about yourself basically what your channel is going to be about what to expect you know who you're targeting uh maybe like give like some personal um personal information is that making sense so write it down so that way when you are ready to record you're not confused you have something that would give you like a foundation and that you can build on and that so that way you're not lost in general that way you know what to say and you are grounded and well grounded again this is something that every pro youtuber does it will save you a whole lot of 
time trying to because trust me the first experience is going to be the hardest so anything that can ease that experience and make it easier you definitely want to be doing that so write it down so that way you don't forget it if you have any key points you want to talk about keep writing it down so that way when you're finally in front of the camera if you're having like a camera fright or you know you're scared or something or you're nervous you have something to remind you of what you need to say okay cool so now that we have something written down what i would advise you to do is to pre-practice okay and you might be thinking why do i need to do this like when do i need to do that pre-practice if it's gonna be your first video you probably have or maybe you don't have like a previous experience with being in front of a camera or talking in front of a camera except you are you have like a media experience amazing good for you but if you're someone who is coming from like a totally different um, background and coming here and being from the camera practice in front of a mirror I mean you need to learn how to be comfortable with yourself again stand in front of a mirror talk to yourself um, be comfortable enough to talk to yourself try as much as possible to build that confidence with yourself because the thing is you're not really talking to people when you're recording realistically like physically we are talking to ourselves like I am talking to myself right now because there's nobody here just my camera and me and my camera is not a human being it is an object so technically I'm talking to myself so I need to perfect um, my ability to talk to myself and the best thing to do is to look in front of a mirror so that way you can mirror yourself and see what you look like when you're talking and perfect that a mirror is the best trick guys perfect it with a mirror if you are doing something that doesn't look good you can easily see that and pick that up when you're standing in front of a mirror so if you're talking and you have this habit of scratching your head you can see that when you're in the mirror and that could literally trigger it stop doing that so practice in front of a mirror get comfortable with yourself There's nobody here is just you except you have an entire production team but i want to believe if you're starting off you don't have all that so it's just you it's just your camera recording device to so be comfortable with yourself do what you need to do and kill it in front of a mirror and then you can kill it in front of your camera okay so practice practice and practice okay no one's watching you just yourself so don't be ashamed to do that no shame in it no shame in perfecting so the next thing you need to do before you start filming or when you're about to film is to make sure that you look presentable right so you want to make sure that you groom your hair brush your hair you know brush your beard if you have beards or whatever style you whatever makes you you know comfortable and feel presentable and all that do that do you your style is so unique but as long as you're comfortable in your skin and you feel like you're presentable enough so wear something you know obviously you need to wear so i don't know but i want to believe you need to wear something so dress up wear something and that way people can trust me enough to, to believe that i know what i'm saying because I, I look the part right i look okay so look presentable so that way people are not confused or whether to trust you or whether to believe you or people feel comfortable when they're watching you okay so now you want to go over your script I get my ideas and I do my research a day before I record so a day before I record I write whatever I need to say or whatever key points I need to do I write it all down and have it as precise as possible put all the ideas all down and then the next morning i then film now because there's like an like maybe like 8 10 12 hours difference um it's a new day i probably don't have those same ideas in my head you need to go over the script to kind of refresh your brain on you know what you need to say you know what ideas you had yesterday and how you need to kind of plan it out again go over your script they do it in movies a lot of big youtubers do it it's, there's no shame in it once in a while i look at my script and i'm like okay i'm on point i'm saying the right things and just go over your script there's no one is perfect in this even newscasters they read their script of a teleprompter so who are you not to do that as well your nerves might get the best of you 
So you want to get the best of the nerves before it does that to you. So now that we have all of that done, it's time to record. It's time to set up your recording device, your studio, whatever, wherever you're filming. If you guys are filming on your mobile phone, I have a very detailed video on how to start filming on your mobile phone you guys love that video it has a lot of views here on youtube definitely check it out from microphones the lighting and all that if you guys don't have lighting if you don't have a space don't have a studio and no stress no worry stand in front of your mirror sit in front of your window sit in front of your window wherever it is it could be in your kitchen your living room your balcony your bedroom wherever it is sit in front of that and start recording right you want natural light you always want to be lit up get a tripod if you don't have a tripod get stacks of books get something shoe put that camera put that phone on it and make sure it's stable and make sure that like, you can record and do that check, check out this video if you guys want to see how i do that so you guys can understand what i'm talking about but i also know that a lot of you guys now that are starting now on youtube probably 70 to 90 percent would be recording on their mobile phone so i'll show you what it looks like when i'm recording with my mobile phone on my with my natural light basically in my window just to show you guys what it looks like while i'm here recording in front of this window right here So it looks like absolutely love it sunlight the best if you are filming in your room same thing get into your room set it up this is what it looks like when i'm just filming in my bedroom guys this is the most basic setup you guys could start up with i'm literally sitting on the edge of my bed like literally on the edge of my bed what is your excuse hmm? make you work okay you gotta start from somewhere but the key that you have to start if you are also filming on your dslr camera a professional camera i also have another video for you guys if you guys are recording on your cameras i have this video on my entire setup and all of that so if you still want to enlighten yourself on you know how to set up what you need to do what you don't need to do if you're interested to know how my set currently looks like and how i achieve this set i have like at least five videos on that yes i know click on this link right here it's an entire playlist you would thank me later but i'm very super detailed with my content so now that we have set it up we set up our camera we set up whatever we're using to record our recording device it is now time to hit the record button and start making mistakes it's quick easy and hard and welcome all right so hey loves you as you guys probably probably watching thanks for watching subscribe to my channel hit the subscribe button like oh, what this is so weird so i'm just gonna repeat that over again and continue saying that until i perfect my script and i sound i feel like i've gotten it right okay yes because i'm being realistic with you your first take is you're never going to get that first take you, you probably wouldn't even remember your name and that's the truth guy up until now i still make mistakes when i'm saying like my intro hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is kate Bona. but the thing is when you keep making mistakes it means that you have to keep going over it over it again and again the more you go over it the more you perfect it the more you become it becomes part and parcel of you right so the more you keep saying the same thing over and over again I feel like on YouTube it's a norm to say, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Not because we want to, but because it is now in view, it's now DNA because we see that a lot, we hear that a lot, it has entered into our subconscious, we see that a lot. So it's just inside. And I feel like I want to say something else, but even if I try to say something else, that's the first thing that comes out of my mouth. Okay. So um practice, practice, practice. You might get the, the first line wrong a couple of times and it's totally okay everybody does that we all feel and make mistakes at the first and you make mistakes the first take but the thing is to continue 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 practice makes perfection so if you get it wrong the first second third fourth don't stress yourself we all do it we all you get, you get it wrong 
the point is for you to continue continue con and i can guarantee you that your 10th take or 20th take or 50th take is definitely going to be better than your first take okay so hit the record button and continue making mistakes so you get it right all right so when you finish recording it's now time to edit your video and get it ready for the youtube platform i do have a video on how i edit my video content on my mobile phone right here i'll leave the link over here however if you guys would like to see like an updated technique and updated process on how to edit using your mobile phone let me also know down in the comment section as well but yeah film and edit your content so now that we have edited the content the last step this is the most important guys the last step is for you to not overthink it do not overthink it do not overthink the video you just filmed and edited and all of that don't overthink it because the more you overthink about it the more you see flaws the more you see imperfections and the more you you tend to not want to post it okay again bear in mind that your first video no matter how perfect it is it is always going to be your worst video because in life you should always look for how to move like this you always want to progress right you don't want to be like this or decline you want to progress so your first video is here your second video is here your third video is here your fourth video is here your, you know that's how you're gonna keep going and I'm saying this because I recorded my first video like three years ago <sighs> I don't know what I was thinking <laughs> Hi guys. Hi, my name is Kilichi and welcome to my channel. <laughs> well, I just did it and here we are three years later and I'm so, I'm so thankful that I did not overthink it. And that video that I posted, first of all, has led me up until now indirectly, whether I want to believe it or not, because if I did not post that video, I would have kept on procrastinating till next year, next two years, when I get a camera, when I get a microphone, when I get this, when I get, nothing's ever gonna be perfect. So don't overthink it, just post it up. And if you hate it, that should make you want to make the next video better than that. If you hate the next, that should make you continue progressing and uploading better content. And that's just how life works, okay? Your first video should be your worst. If it's, your, if it's not your worst, then you're doing something wrong. If your first video is your best video so far, then you do something wrong. And that's not how you should work, okay? First video after recording, filming would not count as your first video unless you actually publish it and it goes live on YouTube, okay? So you can film that video, have it on your phone for years. It doesn't count. Okay, so make it count and start doing something. At least, you know, it's not perfect, but start. Um, yeah, I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I just wanted to create this content for anyone who is starting off with creating YouTube um, videos. I feel like the first video I should have uploaded would have been like a get to know me, not really get to know me, like a introduction to my channel before i started doing like makeup and all that because i feel like people still don't know me i will still do like an intro content like an intro channel trailer to talk about myself and my channel maybe like two three four minutes worth of content so you guys can know me and know what the channel is about that is very key that is so important a channel trailer very short concise video of what your channel is about you know what you have to offer who you are the point for this video is for you to have an idea of how to film your content if you guys are struggling with lighting camera settings guys let me tell you i have an entire playlist of everything if you don't believe me check out this playlist right here it's gonna take you guys through everything you need to get started with recording and creating video content on channel um give me a thumbs up subscribe like share if you enjoyed this video I'll definitely see you guys in one of my videos subscribe again it is free and i'll see you guys in one of my videos stay fabulous get started and stay blessed <music>